Hey everyone, it's Tiger Mask here with our newest episode of Fishing with Fangs, the 2018 fishing guide for Final Fantasy XIV, starring yours truly. So today, we've, we've already covered getting started in fishing, we've covered class quests that are somewhat important and all that jazz, because you know, you gotta do those, you can't move the class forward. I mean, you can level it up, but you really should do those. And today, we're gonna discuss probably the least wonderful part of the game and that's the grind uh, a lot of times the grind is what kills people just drives them up a wall um, so we're gonna cover that a little bit and I'm gonna talk about some tips that I follow to make the grind not so bad so let's get started with so here we are in our little area oh, I put away my fishing right there we go and some people will say, well, you don't have to grind, you can do fish levy quests. And that's true, you can. Um, and we'll cover that in the next video more. But basically what those are, are simple quests that are given out uh, by specific quest vendors just to go fish. So it's the same thing as grinding, it's just you get a bigger reward at the end so you don't have to do it as much. Um, the bad part is where I'm at right now in the game, it's faster to do this because the levy quests kind of suck. So I'm at the 28 to 30 mark and uh, it gets it gets better at 30, but from like 26 or 25 to 30, it's not that great. So the best thing to do is to come out here uh, and toss your line. Now I am in, uh, I'll pull up my map, it's Northern Thailand. Uh, we are near uh, the Ceruleum Processing Plant. So there's a, a waypoint here and a waypoint here. I recommend this one, obviously, because we're just fishing here in town where it's safe. No mobs to worry about and all that jazz. And, uh, yeah, we're getting 14,000 experience points per catch on these. Of course, I'm getting 200% XP. I don't have the guild buffs on or any of that. Just the road to 60 buff, but it's, it's a lot of XP. So, what do you do when you're out here grinding? Uh, because it's not exactly very interactive. The number one tip I can give here, um, that is one that I don't follow enough, but I think really helps me out, is have someone to talk to. Man, if you're playing this game with other people and you got people talking in free company chat or on your Discord server, things like that, that really helps get through these grindy parts. You can talk about anything, and you don't really have to pay attention while you're fishing. You just got to listen for those little... Oh, it hooks noises, you know? And then just keep catching these fish and keep on going. Now, let's say you don't have any friends. Um, <laughs> what do you do? Well, what I recommend here is not music. Uh, music puts me to sleep. Uh, I prefer watching TV shows on Hulu or Netflix that I've seen a million times before. And the reason I say that is because... Hey, look at that. See? You don't want to watch something you haven't seen before because you're going to want to pay attention to it. Uh, and you're really not paying attention to either thing, but you do kind of have to keep a closer eye on the game screen than you will on any sort of media that you're watching. So, what constitutes a good show to watch while grinding for XP? Um, tons of stuff. It really depends on what you like, but here's a list of things that I would probably watch. Oh, Stupid Fish Got Away. Um, Futurama is my number one pick. I think I've watched the whole series of Futurama on loop probably 10 or 15 times at least. And then I also fall asleep to it a lot. So Futurama is good. Family Guy is good. Simpsons are good. Bob's Burgers is good. American Dad is good. Venture Brothers is good, even though there's not that many episodes of it. Rewatch Rick and Morty. Um, Firefly is good. Buffy the Vampire Slayer is good. Rewatching Friends is good. Rewatching Scrubs is good. Rewatching How I Met Your Mother is good. Rewatching X Files is good. Rewatching uh, Ghost in the Shell is good. Rewatching Cowboy Bebop is good, as long as it's in English. Or if you're more comfortable with the Japanese version, grab the Japanese version. Uh, Rewatching the IT Crowd is good. Rewatching Game of Thrones is good. Rewatching Boardwalk Empire might be good. Rewatching Sopranos might be good. Uh, Rewatching anything that has a ton of seasons, a bunch of short episodes, some clever quippy jokes that you remember, or maybe you don't remember, uh, that you might want to hear again. Another good option, especially if you have Hulu, is just watch their movies, because most of them are old boring movies, uh, or old movies that you enjoyed once, and maybe you, you don't mind watching them again, but you're not interested in actually paying attention to the film. Um, Deuce Bigelow Mil Gigolo is a good choice here. 
<laughs> um, not a great movie, but there are some pretty clever jokes, and you don't need to be watching the screen to enjoy them. Uh, stand-up comedy is good uh, to watch. Uh, maybe a podcast, uh, you know, a conversation like the Joe Rogan Experience. I'm only going to recommend that now because I, I'm halfway through the Elon Musk one, and uh, it's pretty, pretty, pretty good. It's pretty good stuff. The news is kind of covering the not interesting parts. But anyway, I digress. Um, one of my friends who spends a lot of time grinding in Diablo 3 actually listens to audiobooks. So if that's up your alley, pick up an Audible account and uh, or Amazon audiobooks or whatever service you want and listen to some audiobooks. And before you know it, you will have leveled up your character. Um... That high quality just gave me 36,000 XP to a point where you don't have to level anymore. You know, you, you'll be done. Uh, so those are the two best ways. Number one being talk with somebody else. You know, have that sort of online interaction that makes an MMO part of an MMO. You know, because if you're out here fishing alone, that's no fun. You know, it's that's why I'm making a YouTube video while I'm doing this right now. Because this is more fun. It feels like I'm talking to people. If I was sitting here alone, I would go mad and I would stop in like seconds and it would not be ple it wouldn't be fun, wouldn't be pleasurable. Um, hell, if your uh, free company is pretty big into social events, have a fishing day where everyone gets to go out and, and fish in different areas or something like everyone travels to each zone where the lowest person needs to level up and then as that person gets leveled up they move to the next zone and the next zone and the next zone. Of course you end up with a crap ton of fish which isn't good for conservation which we'll go over in another video. Um, but you'll be really social, you'll have a big fun time with a bunch of people you can take some screenshots and all that jazz and have a great social interaction. And uh, yeah, so just sitting here talking we've almost completely chewed through level 29. You can see my XP bar is right here and we are on the tail end of this level. We will be 30 soon and we can pick up the next class quest and start our grind into 35. Uh, and then go back to levy quests, which we, like I said, we'll discuss in another, another uh, episode. But Let's see, what else can you do to beat the grind? Um, some people watch sports, you don't really need to, you know, you, but I, a worry with sports is I like to catch the good plays and I would have to look away from the screen and do one of these numbers and then I might miss a hook or something. It's not like it matters that much. You know, you're not in a hurry here, but if you want to be effective, you want to kind of focus on the fishing screen more than any other screen. So sometimes you're just going to have to do that in, on this class. Just like any other gathering profession, there's going to be some times where you're going to have to just grind it out. Uh, mining is really big on grinding it out, but there are levy quests for that as well. Uh, but we're sticking with fishing. Not too big a deal. Uh, I've usually been able to level up enough per class quest that once I've turned in the class quest, I'm ready for the next class quest. That's changing now that I'm getting closer to 30, which is, you know, the halfway point, in a sense, uh, to being done with fishing. Um, so you just kind of got to go through those things. And if you need any more recommendations on stuff to watch uh, while uh, while grinding, put them in the comments. Let me know what you guys do when you're grinding while fishing so that uh, we can all grind together. That doesn't sound right. <laughs> so we're going to keep this going for just a few more minutes. Let's go ahead and get it. Uh, let's show that we can actually stick around for the grind. Have some uh, some focus and dedication. Don't lose attention on something else. Then keep it going. There we go. Ah, what do we need? Like four more fish, maybe? And you can try to do that. If you like figuring, <laughs> if you like mathematics and statistics, maybe make a game out of it. Like, all right, I'm catching fish at 9,000 uh, fish a catch. I need around 15,000. So I'm going to need five or six more fish. Boom. We just figured out how many more fish we're going to have to catch on the grind before it's over. Now, if we happen to pull another high quality, that's going to throw our, our estimate up. Which I guess could be surprising, because you're like, oh wow, I wasn't expecting that. See, look, we just made it that much more fun, right? <laughs> I don't know if that works. 
What's really crazy about this fishing hole is, I don't know where the water is. I have no idea what we're throwing this fish out of. Um, and there we go. We just hit 30 with our fish. Put our fishing rod away. So, thanks everybody for tuning in to this video. Uh, we hope to see you next time when we discuss levy quests and go over the alternate ways to get XP so that you don't have to grind as much. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to do the like, subscribe, all that blah 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 blah. Apparently if you don't say that, people don't do it. So I'm going to say it so people do it. And we will see you next time. Bye everyone.